We see Jack surrounded by small piles of salvaged parts, books on expert level mechanics, and stacks of hand-drawn blueprints on folded pieces of paper made soggy by the snow. Jack hammers away at the handcrafted spears made with salvaged metal, her hammering conflicting with Tobias Touchstone's morning tune that he had promised everyone in the AM just before heading to the school. However, the camp doesn't mind because Jack's expertise has placed tools in their hands that have saved lives many times over. That and because she's always hammering away at something and everyone kind of became numb to it. In episode one of The Village, Jacqueline Smith is introduced with the party who made it to the school first. She is seen giving Joe a metal scrap spear once she learned that he was going in alone. Now in my opinion, I feel this gesture stems from growing up as the only female with all older brothers. She seems to have this strong and resourceful do-it-yourself attitude, and as opposed to asking Joe not to go in alone or offering to go with, she respects his courage and independence, and so she offers something even better. Great tools. Just imagine living with strong individuals. You tend to learn that their word is their word, and if they needed help, they would ask. Despite being 12, we also notice that Jack has a bit of a bad mouth. This is something that the player highlighted as a trait of Jack's, and I think it's a great touch because it takes that soft innocence away and replaces it with the bravado often seen in adults twice her age. I would assume that most in the settlement probably view her as an adult. The player of Jack also said that she tends to latch on to the older tough guys in the settlement in order to be quote unquote one of the guys. I thought this was another interesting trait that made sense to me because that was the type of relationship that she had had with her family. Jack has went through some trauma losing her family in a freak attack. <laughs> a freak attack. And having to kill her own father and little brother who became freaks themselves, she's been through it. I'm curious of the importance of family and what it means to her at this point. 12 year old experiencing a loss like that I'm wondering if that is a void that she's looking to replace or will she distance herself from love and family as not to lose it again we know so far that she's caring and brave because despite her small frame she picked up Danny's shotgun and laid waste to the freak attacking Randy a scene that displayed her courage and willingness to support her allies one thing's for certain one thing's for certain by her successfully scavenging items for materials to cannibalize. Between her and Harmony, Jack will be paramount in the settlement's survival and based sustainability. Jack was rewarded with being able to commence any two major projects and finish them in half of the time thanks to the abundance of salvaged goods. I personally look forward to seeing what she comes up with as well as what relationships are forged with her and the other characters.